Hey guys, this is a video on time complexity. So we have the problem here. It says an algorithm known to be big O of n cubed requires 50 seconds to solve a problem of size n equals 16. How long will it take the algorithm to solve a problem of size n equals 20? So first we have to set up the problem. And we do that by uh, saying, well, we create a function of time. We call it t. And it takes an input size of n. And that time equals something. So what we have here is they said um, we have an algorithm known to be big O of n cubed. So what does it mean for an algorithm to be big O of n cubed? It means that it's equal to some constant times n cubed. Okay. Um, it says that an, an algorithm known to be big O of n cubed requires 50 seconds to solve a problem with size n equals 16. So our input size is n and uh, t of 16, that's our input size, is equal to some constant times 16 cubed, and it equals 50 seconds. Okay, so uh, we just set up our equation there for what we know. And now the question is, and I'm going to put a little line here so we can go down here, we're kind of switching off. The question is, how long will it take the algorithm to solve a problem of size n equals 20? So we want to know what t of 20 equals. Okay, so we can set up t of 20 the same way. We know that t of 20 is equal to c times 20 cubed. And we still don't know what this answer is yet. But notice um, this constant here. If we can figure out what that constant is, we can solve for t of 20 and we can get our answer. So a way to solve for that constant is to take this value here, uh, the equation here, I'm sorry, and figure out what the constant equals. So to do that, we're going to rewrite uh, the above equation here. Okay, so we get t of 16 divided by 16 cubed is equal to c. And remember our t of 16 is equal to 50 seconds. So we we'll write that as 50. And now we're going to plug in 50 over 16 cubed for C. Okay. Um, in the second equation. So we're just going to plug it in for this equation here. So now we get t of 20 is equal to 50 over 16 cubed times 20 cubed. And what does this equal? It equals 97.65625 seconds. Okay, um, thank you guys, and I hope that this video really helped out. Uh, please uh, leave me any comments or any questions, and please subscribe. Thank you guys. See you on the next video.